So I'm just varnishing up some paintings. I've been using Gamvar Gloss, which is a, uh, it's good for oil paintings and acrylics. And I really like this because you don't have to wait like a year for your paintings to dry. You just want it to be at least dry to the touch. And I've been trying to hold off and wait a little bit longer for mine. Um, just because I have been painting thicker and I don't use thinners, so it uh, might take a little longer for mine to dry. But here are some paintings that are newly varnished and ready for the store. My store is heatherinartstore.com. And to give you an idea of the prices, I generally go by sizes. This is a 6x8 painting. This size goes for about... Um, 225 I believe this one's on a cradled panel and you know I can take off the tape and it should be nice and clean you can hang it as is sorry didn't go quite as planned anyway I'll do that later but you can hang it you can just simply put on some uh, wires on the back or you could hang it in a frame but I really like these cradled panels so there's this one. I also have some five by sevens. Here's a newly varnished one. And this size is 170, I believe. I do ship all over the world. I've had paintings in England, Singapore, Australia, just kind of everywhere. Here's another one that I just varnished. And this one was so satisfying because of that cherry filling. So it looks bright and red and juicy. So this size, I forget how much this one is. I think probably around 170. I, I need to check, but it should be on my store. They are signed and ready to go. I just have this one varnished. And this one also was kind of fun because it's very glassy and shiny. It works well with the varnish. Some are super fun to varnish up. Here is a 8x10. The 8x10s are $375. And I price, I try to price by square inch. It's kind of not perfect in my pricing system, but um, they're generally about the same so as you get bigger they're gonna get more expensive so I have quite a variety of sizes this is a 6 by 12 I believe maybe not something like that if you're really lucky you might get a cat hair in a painting I try to take them out but it's pretty impossible to get all of them here's another one that i did just varnished and it, it looks really nice varnished up the iphones do tend to raise the contrast a little bit i'll try to lower it in post-production but um just so you know Here's another one. This is a 10 by 10, I believe. It I forget the cost of this one, but it's on my website as well. I varnished up quite a few of these. This one's also varnished. Looks really nice. The varnish just makes it a little bit richer, a little bit how it looks like with wet paint and how I intend it to look. It also protects the painting from any uh, elements. So, but I think it looks really nice. And you don't even need glass, which is the beauty of oil paintings in my opinion. And it's kind of one reason why I keep doing oils. It's just so much easier to frame. Here's an 8x10, 375. I really like this one. 
It's Japanese grapefruit and they're such an interesting flavor. Very sweet, but not too sweet. And I love how uh, the plastic bag is just slightly translucent. Here's some more that I varnished. This one's the makeup demo that I did. It looks good, nice and shiny. Another demo that I did for Patreon. So you can join my Patreon. I have a link in the store, or I mean in um, Instagram, and you can follow along and paint with me. I do a live stream once a month. This one, I really like this one. Sorry, I have a lot that I recently varnished. Actually, I'm not sure if I varnished this one. It looks a little dull. They won't be super shiny and slick like I just showed you, like these ones. It's going to be a little more dull. These are still pretty wet, so it will soften down a bit, but it's still going to have a glossy sheen to them. Here's the roses that I painted the other day, and this was varnished a little while ago, so this will give you an idea of what it looks like uh, post-varnish and dried. Oh, by the way, this one is a 9x12, I believe, which is 450. Here's another one that I varnished. 6x8, so this one is 225, which I think is pretty fair. It's the same, pretty much the same as the Artist Support Pledge. So I think um, there's a good price for just about anyone out there and the shipping will be free for anything over $50 in the store to people in the United States uh, it's extra <clears throat> depending where you are in the world but I'll try to accommodate and I always try to include a few extra little gifts to show my gratitude but that is all thank you all for watching sorry I ended up showing you a lot more than I initially thought, but I'm almost literally swimming in, here you go. There's the full view. It's, they're taking over the entire house. I have more over here stacked and they probably shouldn't be stacked like this. There's just, they're everywhere. But, um, yeah, I would love to clear up some space. So if you've been wanting to buy painting and just wanted to see a different view, hopefully this video gives you a better idea of what the paintings look like. This is the one I did today. So thank you all. Uh, I appreciate your support and have a great rest of your week.